a tremendous blend of, of power and speed and a very subtle um, yet explosive move um, that he possessed. In, in, in some regards, when you look, um, you can't dispute his body of work ever. I mean, he's a single season um, rushing uh, um, title holder. I mean, you know, for a single year, you know, the, the most yards that any running back has had in the history, in the history, in the history of the National Football League. You can't, you know, uh, you, 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 there, there's, there, you know, you can't dispute that. He was a beautiful to watch. I mean, because once he broke, I mean, it was nobody that was going to catch him. Nobody. You know, he, he had some challenges along the way, and to do that, despite all the challenges, you know, it's even more impressive. You know, um, there's no doubt about his greatness. Um, you know, some people may not give him his due because he had a few front office run-ins and, and things like that, but you can't deny the talent um, that Eric Dickerson had. I mean, that kind of talent, that size, that, that strength, that speed, those moves, you know, they, they happen once every leap year, you know. Um, or twice every leap year. I mean, it just it doesn't happen often. Um, and when you see a guy like that uh, come in the league and play to that level and, and, and establish those records and, and, and set such a standard, it can only be admired. Well, I, I just think that um, uh, he wanted to be um, a great player. And when you want to be great, all the things that you do in order to get there aren't considered work. It's a pleasure to do those things. Um, it's exciting to do those things. Um, Eric has a lot of pride. And he wanted to go someplace. He, he, I, I think he, you know, he didn't, he, he's one of those guys, he didn't want to write his name in wet cement, you know, and said I was here, or carve his name in a tree. Uh, he wanted people to know uh, who he was, how fast he really was. There's only one guy I think that uh, caught him. Uh, and that was Daryl Green, and everybody knows that Daryl Green is probably one of the fastest players that ever played in the history of the game. Um, but if you eliminate Daryl Green, <laughs> I don't think anybody ever caught him from behind. Once he got in the open, it was it was over. At almost six three and a half, two, I don't know what he was, but it was it was a freak of nature. He really was. I mean, he was, he had it all. He had the size and he had the determination. He had the will. He wanted to be great. It was clear. You can see the way he played the game.